Hey there everyone, it's Thackard and welcome to another video for Sunken Land, that wonderful Waterworld themed survival game. Today I'm going to be talking about my three favorite low risk looting locations. So let's get straight to it. The first of our locations is the apartments. Now this is just to the north, northwest of the starting island. It's probably gonna be one of the first things that you will actually find. Its positioning is around 61250-ish, and there is a lot of great stuff here. The buildings inside of the apartments are loaded with stuff you need early on. Looking at this one, we have right here, we have some cloth. And then in the same room, we have scrap, wood, we have medicinal supplies. And then over here, we have food supplies. And this is just one room. Going down a level, we even have a safe that we can use, as well as more scrap and more food. The apartments are just loaded with everything you need early on. The apartments even have some components that you will need a little later on for things like advanced crafting including rubber and components. In fact, they have several of these toolboxes in different locations, and you can get components, rubber, glass, metal, wood, basically anything from those boxes. The second location we're going to be talking about is the refinery. Now, it is way to the north, but you can get there without much issue. And just like everything else we're going to be talking about today, it's safe. There are no sharks around to worry about. Looking at the map, you can see, just as I said, it's to the north of the starting island. It's located approximately 750 by 1800. And it is fairly easy to get to. Scattered around the refinery, you will find red barrels. These contain chemicals that you can use to make ammunition for your weapons. If you go down into the refinery itself, you can find this large storage crate. You can find an advanced storage crate that has advanced parts in it. You can find this weapons crate that might have gun parts or a broken weapon. And then you can also find even a safe in the back room. And this will contain, well, blueprints and basically everything else. The last location I'm going to talk about is the highway passes. Now this is a very large area located to the south of the starting island and even to the south of the vendor. It's pretty easy to find and get to, just takes a little time, that's all. Its location is roughly 750 by 250 and it is loaded with a lot of advanced supplies just like the refinery is. As I said, we have a lot of the same supplies that we had at the refinery, including chemicals. Now the thing that this area has that the refinery doesn't is electronics. They have a lot of these green electric boxes that you can use and they are just loaded with electronics. The area also has several of these large storage boxes that can have those blueprints and a lot of other good gadgets in them as well as several advanced storage boxes with advanced parts. And there you have it everyone, my three favorite low risk looting locations. The apartments with its early game items and then the refinery and the highway passes with its late game items, its ammunition creating items, as well as blueprints and broken weapons. If you have found this interesting, helpful, entertaining, any of the above, all of the above, none of the above, please give it a thumbs up. The YouTube algorithm really likes it when you do that. Please leave a comment down below with your choices of low risk looting locations. If you have any questions about my three locations, or if you have any ideas for videos you would like to see me do in the future, please leave those down below as well. This game has many threats from enemies with guns, enemies with knives, enemies with fists, and enemies with lots of very sharp teeth. At least this video will help you avoid that last one for just a little bit longer. Thank you very much for watching the video and please think about dropping a sub for me. Alright, 
as you are out there getting that loot so you can get your weapons so you can kill the bad guys while you're doing all that just remember to bring it no matter what you do see you later